If you want to be good at COD, this is all you have to do. What's good? What's poppin'? How y'all feeling? How y'all living, man? It's Cha Money, leader of Boop Gang, man. Co-founder of the Taliban, dude. Back with something new for y'all, man. Yeah. Some of y'all saying, what the fuck are you doing on this game? And some of y'all saying, oh yeah, he's on a new Call of Duty. Yeah, with the whoop. But really, dude, this is um my review of the game right now. Um, I actually have this full video that's not muted, you know what I'm saying, music in the background and all of that on my other channel that I got joint with my homeboys, uh, you can see it at the top, Boop, um, Boop Gang Taliban, you feel me, I should have a link in the description soon for y'all, you feel me, so y'all can just click straight on it, go subscribe to them, you feel me, but this on my channel is gonna be a review, I'm so ready for this dude, I got stuff wrote down, I got the pros and the cons, and I guess I'll start off with the pros right now. And number one, I would say, you know, it got good graphics, you feel me? Uh, you could change the blur. And what the blur is, like, if you guys are paying attention, every time I turn or I jump over something, it's like blur. But to me, that kind of make the game look, look good, you know what I'm saying? My boys be turning it off because they say, like, they can't see because, you know, it's blur. But I actually like it, you know what I'm saying? It make the game smooth and make it look good. Okay. <clears throat> number two. And, oh, by the way, I only got four pros, so. <laughs> number two uh you can edit and change classes whenever you want um and by that mean i mean if you hit options you can edit the loadout i don't know if you uh might want to rewind it and go to the beginning um i was over there adding my loadout and stuff like that you know what i'm saying uh changing stuff you can you can put different uh what do they call it on here fill upgrades like reload boxes and tack inserts and stuff like that dead silence you can do all that stuff you can put different scopes on your gun you know that's pretty cool to me you could just you know what i'm saying automatically just change everything bro that's just it's pretty cool um Number three, let me see what I say. Uh, oh yeah, you can load into games fast, and it's and the game actually loads up pretty fast. Like when you click it, start application, um, you can skip right past this screen that's horrible on your ears. Like it's way too loud. You can skip right past that man. Go right into the loading screens, which is actually pretty good. And you load into games fast. And I also like that. Uh, it doesn't be the same lobby like you might well I don't know I mean that's kind of good and kind of bad because sometimes you're in the lobby with a lot of trash dudes you know what I'm saying you're trying to go hard on them but you know what I'm saying but that's actually kind of good because then again if you're getting trashed on you're like yeah I'm not playing them again you feel me but you're not you can't play them again because it loads a different lobby for you so and finally last but not least um, I heard it was a good story mode on here as you all know Black Ops 4 didn't have a campaign, you know what I'm saying? So I heard campaign mode on here is actually pretty good. Plus, you get multiplayer um, characters and stuff like that unlocked while playing campaign. And I think you can get, um, what is it called? Double XP for multiplayer if you play the campaign too. I, th I think though, don't quote me on that. I, I just heard and watched a couple of videos and seen it, you know what I'm saying? But I have yet to dabble in the campaign yet. I, I think I actually am though to get the costumes and the double XP, you know, with the, even though they say the double XP is only like 15, 30 minutes, which is only like one ground war game or two uh, hard point uh, headquarter games, I mean, you know what I'm saying? But <laughs> let's get to the. Uh, nitty gritty <laughs> okay oh fun fact for y'all this is the best selling cod right now this is this is one of the best selling cards it sold six million dollars within three days but another fun fact for y'all mw3 and bo2 so 500 mil within 200 uh oh i said within 200 hours S scratch that within 24 hours <laughs> you know what i'm saying so do y'all think it's a money thing because you know, back in the day, was it the hundred dollar version of Black Ops ordering on your on your game? So, do you think Call of Duty is is saying they're the best selling game by like money standpoint? Do you get what I'm saying, or are they saying it by copies? You know what I'm saying? Like, how many copies did everybody buy? Because, uh, like I said, like I was telling my boys earlier, if if we all spend five dollars, I mean fifty dollars, 
well, sixty dollars really, sixty five if you buy it on your game. Um, on five of these, you know, it's not gonna equal as much as spending a hundred dollars on three of them. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, well, it, it is, but you, you get what I'm trying to say. Like, it's gonna add up more more profit because they charging a hundred dollars for some extra dumb shit that everybody gonna buy, even though it's dumb shit. Because I did that shit on Black Ops Four, and they literally sold this stuff to people for like five dollars. When I, I, you feel me? I could have just did that instead of paying a hundred for the game. I could have just waited until they brought it out for everybody and spent five. You know what I'm saying? They be on some dumb stuff. But what else? Um, oh, footsteps. Way too loud, dude. Way too loud, dude. <laughs> like that's a no no. It literally promotes camping and the dead silence perk that they have on here. I mean, it's all right because you have to kill somebody though. And it keeps going on, you know what I'm saying? Because dead silence only lasts for a couple of seconds. It's, it's not like Black Ops 4, you feel me? But it shouldn't be because this is an Activision game, which is which is good. But I'm saying that dead silence, I don't know. The, the footsteps, I don't know about, bro. They just way too loud, dude. Like, if anything, you should make it to where you can't hear your partner footsteps. I don't know. That probably make it even worse. But, dude, the footsteps is way too loud, dude. The time to kill on this game, bro. It's way too fast to me if y'all are going to have shotguns shooting us from deep ass ranges. One shot, you know what I'm saying? Like, you need to make the time to kill either faster or something, dude. Y'all need to do something, okay? And who changed the radar? Please tell me. Somebody changed the radar. So now when people shoot, it's a compass. When have we ever needed a compass on Call of Duty? Who uses a compass? We don't need a compass, dude. This isn't Fortnite, dude. Okay? It's boring. Colors. Not not the game is boring. The, the colors are boring. Which I get it. Y'all trying to go for a real look. But it's hard to see, dude. Like, y'all got to make something a little brighter, dude. Okay? And it's big-ass maps, dude. Like, these maps is way too fucking big, dude. Like, I need to do something with these maps, dude. And Ground War, I don't know about that, bro. This ain't Battlefield, dude. I mean, people like Ground War. Ground War is all right. I ain't gonna lie. But sometimes people stay in the tank and a uh, drop a nuke, literally. You can stay in the tank the whole game, drop good nuke, bro. Literally, if you want to drop a nuke, go get in the tank. <sighs> and I think I'm done, yeah. Other than that, though, it's pretty all right. I will, I will say, I was thinking about this all day. I probably said six out of ten. I would say this is one of the third worst Call of Duties under Infinite Infinite Warfare is the worst Call of Duty to me. Then Advanced Warfare, and then it'll be this probably, or World War Two, and then this. I don't know. I'm really not a Modern Warfare player. So, anyways, like, comment, and subscribe, man. I'm gonna have another Call of Duty video coming out for y'all. You know what I'm saying? Tomorrow it should not, if not the date after tomorrow and a 2k uh cage video for y'all man and also make sure to check out the other youtube channel boop gang talibans man we going hard on there dude Rah!